Latera is an absorbable nasal implant and addresses a key factor of nasal airway obstruction by supporting the lateral wall. Upon inhalation, the nasal sidewall will collapse using a cerumen loop. The modified caudal can be used to diagnose patients with lateral wall insufficiency. This acts as a support to the lateral wall. There should be no change in appearance of the sidewall. Select the Latera implant size, 20 millimeters or 24 millimeters, based on patient anatomy. To begin the procedure, plan proper placement based on the patient's anatomy. Mark the caudal edge of the maxilla and the area of collapse. Use the provided planning tool to mark where the implant atraumatic tip and forks will sit on the lateral wall. When planning, the implant should cross the upper and lower lateral cartilage. The atraumatic tip should be in the area of collapse and the forks rest on the maxilla. Line the planning tool to be parallel with the dorsum. This will help locate the pivot point. The pivot point should fall in the area of collapse. Maintain the pivot point and pivot the forks laterally on the maxilla. Once satisfied with the placement, mark the forks, the atraumatic tip, and then a third point on the ala for the pierce point. Using the alar retractor, evert the ala with the index or ring finger. Hold the alar retractor close to the prongs for greater control. Align the latera device perpendicular to the septum. The bevel will be towards the septum. The depth marker will be visible. Pierce where the internal nasal lining begins, close to the alar rim. Maintain the perpendicular direction until the depth marker is barely visible or disappears. Resistance should lessen once the correct plane is accessed. Rotate the Latera device to align parallel with the septum. Apply counter traction using the ALAR retractor and advance the trocar to the trajectory of the pre-marked placement, aiming towards the lower edge of the maxilla. Periodically, lateralize the tip of the device to ensure depth is appropriate. This will be in the subsmass plane. After reaching the lower edge, Reorient to allow the bevel to slide over the bone of the maxilla on the planned path, stopping at the last marking. This will ensure the proper amount of the implant, approximately eight millimeters, will be on the maxilla. Lateralize to tent the skin to ensure alignment with the planned path. Before deploying the implant, ensure the fork orientation features are aligned parallel to the maxilla. Stabilize the trocar of the Latera device, and without applying pressure to the device, push the deploy button. Slowly advance only the handle of the device forward. This is how the implant is placed within the tissue. Slowly retract the Latera device in the same path of insertion. Check the pierce points to ensure the implant is not visible intranasally. Help your patients experience what it's like to breathe easier with Latera.